One half of the earth here is uninhabitable. It stretches far into the distance. The water is poorly explored. The distance is uncertain. Nothing can break the monotony of this long crossing. Our expedition was poorly equipped thanks to our backers, who told me that we could fill our pockets with goods carried on the first enemy ship that we find. Alas, we've encountered none thus far. When our food supply began to run low, the crew took to distracting themselves away from her flying towards no drink and gambling. Indeed, suspicion. They are men of the taverns, workhouses, prisons, and other obscure professions. They are always battling amongst themselves. These were men who had earned reputations. Yet, they wonder who would be the first to want to gamble his life on such an adventure. <laughs> and who told me they would work very hard, but this was not the case. They were here merely because they were convinced that they would become rich and find fame, not understanding the hardships they would have to face. A ship appeared along the way, the Quidda Merchant. It flew a Dutch flag. Its name suggested it belonged to an Indian fleet its crew probably from various ports 